All right, now today we found out that Nike has removed Ja Morant sneaker from the website and the mobile app. Now, this is really sad because Ja Morant was just like really getting his signature shoe. He got a new logo. I saw the Nike commercial. Everything seemed to be going well with his shoe. And now Nike is saying, look, the first time we let you get away with it. But the second time now we have to do something. Now, just because they removed the shoe from the app and the website doesn't mean that they have terminated their deal with Ja Morant. But right now it lets me know Nike is trying to figure out what their future with Ja is going to look like. But we did have a couple of kind words from Steven Jackson. Let's check it out. Hey, question. How many people been in the NBA and been in a situation where they made a mistake and almost lost their job? How many people been in the NBA and did something where they got fined $3 million and suspended 30 games. How many people was in the NBA, ended up at a strip club, trying to defend your teammates, and ended up shooting your gun at the strip club and getting arrested for it, and getting in more trouble for it while you in the NBA, and getting suspended seven more games and losing more money? How many people can say they did that? Right. I've been there. I have experience with this. I've made mistakes. I've shot a gun, but I bounce back. It's not by what you do. It's what you do after. Jack going to be good. Steven Jackson was a wild boy back in his day. Ron Artest was a wild boy. Gilbert Arenas was a wild boy. Jai's not the first NBA player to mess up. And I do think he'll be okay if he wants to continue playing basketball. But I think a lot of people need to kind of swallow this pill, which is maybe Ja is not focused on basketball. Maybe he wants to do something else with his life, and that's okay too. And I know a lot of people have not agree with my commentary on this situation because I've been hard on Ja but it's because I can understand what Steven Jackson is saying when he's saying hey you know I went to jail I'm somebody who didn't got locked up for being dumb and doing stupid stuff while I was Ja Morant's age me and Ja Morant are not that are not the same age I know I might look a little younger to some of y'all I'm not and when you 22, 23, those decisions can shape the rest of your life. It has to be somebody holding Ja to the fire because unfortunately it looks like, and, and look, I don't know his father. I don't know his mother. All the hearsay and, and rumors could be wrong. He could have a strong parental guidance, um, you know, energy in his house from his mother and his father. But it has to be somebody telling Ja, if you want to be in the NBA, your behavior is not acceptable. But I don't think this is the end for him. If he wants to continue to play basketball, he can do that. He might lose a few endorsements. He might lose a couple of dollars. But he can come back from this. But it's all about what Ja Morant wants to do. Y'all let me know what y'all think about this. Make sure you like the video and subscribe. I'll see y'all next time. Peace.